New at 6, Governor Ron DeSantis was in South Florida today to announce a multi-billion dollar plan to help the Everglades and fight algae blooms. CBS 4's Hank Tester is live at Holiday Park in West Broward with details. Hank? Well, he was across South Florida selling his plan and also making key appointments. Here's the story. Another Florida governor wrestles with what to do about the Everglades. So beautiful, so fragile. And Ron DeSantis has said he wants to leave Florida to God better than we found it. A tough challenge made perfectly clear by the sight of waters racked with red tide and algae. It's great to be in southwest Florida. It's a very beautiful day. The new governor campaigned hard on the environment, promised to keep big sugar at bay, and in Naples this day, highlighting his $2.5 billion budget proposal, which includes an aggressive attack on Lake Okeechobee algae and red tide pollution on both Florida coasts. We are having um, a historic $625 million for water resources projects, including Everglades restoration. DeSantis has asked all the board members of the South Florida Water Management District to resign, and today named Chauncey Goss, a former member of the George Bush administration and Southwest Florida conservationist, as his first appointment to the organization that sets water policy. I don't think all of our water problems that we have in South Florida necessarily come from the Water Management District, but I do know that without the Water Management District, we aren't going to be able to fix all the problems we have in Southwest Florida. DeSantis moved across the state to Holiday Park in Broward County to make another appointment. This, no real surprise, alligator Ron Bergeron, a potent political and economic force in Broward County. It's important to 8 million people, to our quality of life, that we save our environment and it's important to economical growth and jobs because water is the most valuable thing on this planet. Well, the governor says that he has to deal with the situation with the water board. Some of the members are slow to resign. I'm Hank Tester, CBS 4 News. Back to you.